What's going on everyone, welcome back again to another Foxtech video. This time I'll show you how to clear storage on your iPhone without deleting your precious photos. If you're finding your iPhone storage is running low but want to keep all your photos, there are several steps you can take to free up space effectively. The first and most crucial step is to determine what exactly is taking up your storage. For this, open up the settings app on your iPhone, navigate to general, then tap on iPhone storage. You'll need to wait a few seconds as it loads up, but once it's ready, you'll see a visual representation at the top that shows what's occupying your storage space. This breakdown is essential for making informed decisions on what to delete. As we established, you don't want to delete any photos. However, when you look at the storage breakdown, you'll likely see that photos, videos, messages, apps, and other files like are consuming space. One option to consider is deleting some videos, since they often take up a significant amount of storage. You can review your videos and delete those that are particularly large right from this section if you get this recommended. Another effective strategy is to delete apps that you no longer need. For instance, you might find that there are some different apps, like if you just check it out, just take a look at the messages, which are including many attachments, these can be taking up considerable space. You can delete these attachments without affecting your photos. Similarly, check the list of apps to identify any that are consuming a lot of storage. For example, if you see an app like TikTok having up to one gigabyte of space and you don't use it frequently, I mean, it might be worth deleting. It's also worth checking the data stored within certain apps. For example, if you use a video editor, for example, CapCut, the app itself might not, might not take up space but the documents and data within it could be really large. So deleting unnecessary files from these apps can free up significant storage without affecting your photos. And finally, if photos are taking up a substantial portion of your storage and you need to keep them, consider backing them up like you don't have to delete them. Instead, move them to an external drive or iCloud, whatever it is, but this way, you still have access to all your photos without them occupying your space on device. Hope you found this video useful. If you did, hit the thumbs up, subscribe below, and I'll catch you in the future. Peace out until then.